Let's run through the screen icons. At the top left, S indicates still shots. V indicates video mode. These modes can be changed by pressing the left soft key. OPDF indicates that general imaging is in use. This would automatically change should a module be attached. P0001 indicates this is Patient 1 folder. BA indicates battery level as a percentage. The next icon is the time. At the top right is the focus indicator. M is manual, A is auto, Z is zoom. These can be changed by pressing the right soft key. Focusing can be adjusted using the up and down arrows. When zoom is selected, the scale on the left of the screen displays the level of optic zoom selected. In the middle of the bottom screen is the illumination level of the white light, which can be set between 1 and 10. At the bottom right, you can access the menu to adjust the settings by pressing and holding the right soft key. The menu is opened by pressing the right soft key for one second. The menu has six tabs. One is for device settings. There is one tab for retinal imaging, anterior eye imaging, ear imaging, skin imaging, and general imaging. The arrow keys are used to move between tabs. Use the arrow key up until tab is active and use left and right arrow keys to change active tabs. Light blue color indicates the tab is active. The arrow keys change values in the menu. An active value is indicated with a light blue color. Changed values are saved by using the left soft key, OK and cancelled by pressing the right soft key, cancel. Some values are confirmed by pressing the middle key. Let's run through the device settings in the menu. Preview Images Image Preview is opened by selecting Preview Files with the middle key. Patient folders and images are browsed by using the arrow keys. Display gives information about usage of the image preview. Resolution of the image preview is rather small. Preview is intended only for a quick check that all necessary information is captured. It is recommended always to study full resolution pictures on a computer screen. New Patient Folder A new patient folder is created by pressing the middle key when the new patient folder selection is active in the device menu. A new patient folder could also be created by pressing the middle key for three seconds when in live view. If the current patient folder is empty, a new folder cannot be created and patient one folder is used. Erase image memory. Image memory can be erased by selecting Erase image memory. This selection is activated by pressing the middle key. The camera also prompts the question Erase image memory when the camera is powered on or removed from the cradle. Display Brightness The Display Brightness selection has three options, low, medium, and high. Choose the suitable level of display brightness according to how the examination room is lit up. Icons The icons shown on the camera screen can be enabled or disabled to the user's liking. The most essential icons such as the menu icon are always visible. Sounds By default, the camera makes a sound during image capture. This sound can be turned off from the device menu. Keyboard Backlight By default, the camera keys have a backlight lit up when the camera is turned on. This light can be turned off from the device menu if it disturbs the user while taking images. Language The camera has six different languages the user can choose from. The default language is English. USB Write Protection USB write protection is recommended to be turned on by the user. When this protection is on, it will prevent any virus from entering the camera from a computer when connected to the cradle. Video file format The camera has two file formats that the user can choose for videos, MPEG-4 and MPEG-1. MPEG-4 is a higher quality file format but may not be viewed with all video players. MPEG-1 format is more widely supported by different software applications. Image Transfer Method There are two options for the Image Transfer Method, UMS 
USB Mass Storage, or WIA, Windows Image Acquisition. UMS is the standard choice. Restore Factory Settings By selecting Activate in the Device menu and pressing the middle key, Restore Factory Defaults, the original factory settings will be returned. Date Date can be set using the left and right arrow keys. Enable editing by using the middle key. Move between day, month, and year by pressing the middle key. Time Time can be set using the left and right arrow keys. Enable editing by using the middle key. Move between hours and minutes by pressing the middle key. Camera SW version This item in the device menu provides the camera software version.